Finally tonight, remember the name Olivia Hallisey, just a teenager and already making her mark in medical research. Dr. John LaPook introduces us. For this one, it's the TMB substrate. Last year, Olivia Hallisey had so to be the only 16-year-old in the world in. thinking about this. I really wanted to make an Eliza kit temperature independent. You realize yeah. you're not talking like a normal teenager. <laughs> you know that, right? <laughs> what she's talking about is a test for Ebola. Olivia realized existing ones made by adults need refrigeration. No small task in hot climates like West Africa. Did you ever say to yourself, I'm a kid. How can I come up with something better? I think especially in science, it doesn't matter if you're a girl, if you're young, or where you're from. It's really just about your results. What do we need for you, so? Olivia brought the idea to Greenwich High School science teacher Andy so Bramante. When she came to you and said, I want to do a test for Ebola, what was your reaction? Oh, boy. <laughs> so there was a lot of pushback, you know. Uh, Andy, you know, you, don't, you have no business doing this with a student. You know, it's not possible. It's not going to happen. What would you say? I said, let, let me be the judge of that. You know, we'll figure it out. You can still yeah, it's still brighter. Yeah. To fix the refrigeration problem, Olivia came up with a novel test that can work in high temperatures. This is her design, which acts like a pregnancy test. Was there a eureka moment for you? Yeah, the color change indicating the positive result, and it was great when it happened. Olivia Hallisey. She and tens of thousands of other teenagers entered this year's Google Science Fair. Olivia won. Her name got called. It was this release of just emotion, and I'm just woo -hoo. You're an athlete, you're book smart, and you're emotionally intelligent. Are you lousy at anything? <laughs> I think I need help at sometimes taking a step back and looking at things from the bigger picture. Sometimes I get really stressed out if one thing isn't going my way. Has Mr. Bramante helped you with that? Definitely. I think it's just a great lesson he's taught me is never to freak out over the little things because it's still little in the scheme of your whole life. For a high school junior and her science teacher, <laughs> the chemistry could not be better. Dr. John LaPook, CBS News, Greenwich, Connecticut.